Hello people, my name is Rage and welcome and all to some more Pokemon Omega Ruby. The next step in our magnificent journey begins now. Also, this this looks this looks goddamn comfy. I mean, may have been role playing with some furniture there. <laughs> How do you role play with some furniture? Hey, Mr. Chair, how you doing, Sally? I'm doing good, Mr. Chair. Why am I called Sally? I don't know, Sally. Why are you called Sally? I'm an idiot, Chair. But this is not the time to be imagining conversations with furniture. We are not playing Habbo Hotel. Yeah, I may have played Habbo Hotel when I was 12. Don't judge me. Okay, fine. You may judge me, but don't judge me too much. So we now have a letter from Mr. Stone, the President Man, who we need to give to someone... On on du, du, Dubai on uh, in Dubai we need to go to Dubai. Um, actually leave the Pokemon world, enter the real world. But this does mean going back through the forest. I think it may do. I'm a little bit unsure because my sense of direction is absolutely horrible. But at the same time, you know, it's just more adventuring to be had, and I think that is Maddie Maddie Funky Fine Funky. Funky Vines. Funky Vines would be cool, honestly. But yeah, once again, uh, you people, and yes, I mean you people, were absolutely flawless. Absolutely flawless in the comments. Some wondrous, wondrous things were said. And it's just, it's like actual just... It's just, it's just you know how I feel about it. It's, it's a wild ride. And I enjoy cascading down those sweet, sweet comments. And I realize I may be calling things sweet, sweet, insert thing name here often. But you got to remember that it's a, a sweet, sweet thing to do that. Ah, no, but really, I'll try and stop doing that because it's annoying even me, actually. So I don't care about you, shaky Pokemon. I have got all I want from these woods and I have finally passed through them. As we return to Route 104, where the beaches are clean and fresh. And the sailor man does what the sailor man do. I don't really know where I'm going with that, but I do know I need to find Mr. Bray. There we go. I was right. I love being right. Being right is so much better than being wrong, you know? Like, if you had to choose one of the... Okay, I'll play. Whee! Yeah! All right, let's play rig around the table, guys. All right, where's the music going to stop? We're playing musical cushions? Let's play musical... Yeah! All right, old man, I'm catching you. I'm catching you. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you, old man. I'm going to tackle you. I'm going to throw you down, and then we're going to eat your seagull. I mean, um, play with it. Play with your seagull. Wait, actually, asking to play with someone's seagull probably isn't, um, probably isn't good either. We'll just forget all of that happened. Oh, if it ain't Josh, you're the one who saved my Pico. Aye, but we owe you for that day. What's that? You want to sail with me? What's all this about then? A letter from Duford, certainly. That'd be no problem at all. You've come to the right man. Shall we hoist sail for Duford at once? Course we will. Course we will. Let's do it. Let's do it. Away, boat. Spray that briny depth into the air. Another poetic sea-based language as Pico flies alongside, somehow keeping up with the boat to say he's kind of a runty-looking seagull type thing, but I'm not going to worry about that. No, I am not. I will admire your choice of Pokemon as I would admire anyone else's. Unless, of course, they chose something like plain Zubat. I mean, that's a little bit weird. Ahoy! We've struck land in Duford, lad! I suppose you'll be heading ashore to deliver that letter to what's-his-name or whomever. If you're ever feeling lost and adrift, try calling on the island's Pokemon gym, the leader Brawly. Sure knows everyone and everything. I'm hoping that this guy is a water leader, because he's on an island. In which case, Lieutenant Leaf is going to have a, uh, have a fantastic time with it. I think we can all... Agree, it's just going to be absolutely murder. Hey man, how you doing? Thanks, thanks for that. Appreciate it. Hey lady, how you doing? No, okay, you, you, uh, you, you okay, it's fine, that's fine. No, there's a granite cave. I don't care about granite cave. Anything. You sure, sure, you sure, lady? You, uh, you okay? You sure you don't, you sure you're not overcome with my massive amounts of charm? My great balls doing anything for you? No, okay, you sure you don't, okay. maybe if I get some super, super balls, maybe? Master ball, no, okay, fine. Fine. She's stone cold, guys. She's stone cold like the granite cave on the island. Oh, referenced it round. Uh, super training. I don't want no super training. Let the super training burn. Hey, kid. 
tiny island community. So if something gets trendy here, everyone picks up on it right away. Wow, all five of you. Uh, what's going on in here? Duford Hall. Everyone exchanges information here. Well, that's a useless building for me because, I mean, I already know everything. <laughs> ah. Ah. Now we have no idea what a potion festival is, so. Really, is this guy telling me? Okay. Have a potion, friend. Um. Oh, no, he wanted me to tell him what's popular. All right, okay, all right. Well, we're gonna, we've given him a potion, so we're gonna do potion houses. <laughs> oh, it's potion houses time now. The hottest, th oh, okay, all right, I'm gonna have fun with this. Oh, no, I'm not allowed to tell him. Oh, I want to tell him about something else. Damn it, I wish I'd realized. No. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right. Okay. Okay, great ball. Great ball. Okay, what's popular? Great, great ball parties. Great ball schools. No, I got a... Great balls qualities. No, we gotta do great ball, great ball parties. No, great ball masters. No, we gotta be parties, gotta be parties. Great ball parties? <laughs> Ah, yes, let's leave him to tell everyone about the great ball parties we're going to be throwing. Ha! Ah, wonderful. Ah, I love little touches like that. I really do. Feast your eyes on this. It's a silk scarf. Yeah, I want it. Give me it. Give me your silk scarf now. Yeah, you best give me it before I ripped it off your neck. Lovely. Special attack up. Wonderful. Or is it the normal boost? I can't remember. Probably should have listened to him. Whoops. You bothered to cross the sea to visit Juford? Are you here because you heard about Brawly? He's so cool. Everyone idolizes him. That's weird, kid. That's weird. You shouldn't all idolize, like, the sixth guy on your island. I mean, there's probably not that many people going on. Is this technically a route? There's a route here? It's like a tiny little... I mean, if you really insist, I mean, I just, I guess. Oh, you want to you battle? You want to battle? Let's go. I was born in a village far from the sea, so I've always dreamed of coming to Hoenn. Oh, really? Really? You are challenged by Backpacker Graham. Backpacker Graham sent out Slackoth. Well, I really thought it was going to stand up then, but then Slackoth just went and just gave up. All right, Deathbringer, time to buggy bite. I'm going to use Deathbringer until the gym, and then I'm going to put Lieutenant Leaf in the forefront. I think that makes sense. Encore, hit me again with that move that will kill me when I hit you again. Sometimes I, sometimes I just, I don't understand, you know, and it, it, it bamboozles me. It really does, but that's okay. Yay, 17 on the Deathbringer. Gonna do a new move. We are, Morning Sun. Is that a heal? I feel like that's a heal. Nice, that's cool. I like that a lot. We'll get rid of String Shot, because, I mean, really not that useful. So I assume in Sunny Day when the sun weather effect is on the field. That is a really powerful heal. I'm going to assume it's a 50% heal without sun and a 100% heal with sun. That makes sense to me. Wants to learn the move heads. Like Goons like Zig is actually leveling up fairly rapidly, so that's kind of neat. We'll get rid of Growl and switch to Headbutt. Probably going to get rid of Tackle, but I guess they are slightly different moves. Is Headbutt the backfiring one? That's Double Edge, actually. I don't really know what I'm talking about. Who knows Pokemon moves? I mean, really. Hello, fisherman. There's no point fighting you yet. I just want to explore the place. Anything? There better be an item at the end of all this. Aha! I knew it! Oh, bit of protein on the floor. That just sounds like I found a cube of meat just sort of sat there. And I decided to put it in my backpack. And I'm gonna feed it to a Pokemon later. It's beyond, beyond brutal, actually. So we don't have Surf yet, so we don't have to worry about those swimmers who are swimming alarmingly close to the shore. But that's okay. I think what it is time for... Is a little bit of gym action. Yes, it is. Okay, so, Lieutenant Leaf, we will do glorious battle. Yes, we will, with Deathbringer bringing up the rear. Hello! Don't you dare brush me off! It's not my fault if you cry! Well, I guess in that vein, it's not my fault if you cry. Wow, okay, she is really ki- Oh, Battle Girl Laura! Okay, you go for- you kick, try and kick me in the face. So I think we've identified that this gym is actually um, a fighting gym, which is less than ideal, but not the end of the world. So 
we're okay. Fury Cutter! Damn, Enjor. Damn. Can't remember if Bug is super effective or not very. Oh, it's literally neither. Well, I guess Mega Drain? Go for Mega Drain. See that sweet, sweet stab? Okay, so we don't really have anything that can affect that. Oh, no, because Medicham is part Psychic, and Bug is good against Psychic. So... I'm assuming that Fighting resists Bug, which uh, makes sense. So that's probably a potential concern. Whoa! I lost! I made her cry! I love making random girls cry. Wait, no. No. Oh, I see. So I have to... Oh, that's a really cool little thing. So basically, I just have to remember the path. Okay, time to battle you. Might is right, come on! All right, dude, you're a little bit intense, but that's fine. You're challenged by Black Bell, Hideki. Sent out Machop. Well, Machop, how are you doing, Machop? You doing good? I am going to test Fury Cutter on you, and then I will know. Yes, I will. I kind of need to memorize my type matchups again, don't I? But that's okay. Yeah, it's not. See, to be fair, I was correct. I did think the bug was not very effective against fighting. So I'm glad we found this out now rather than later. Mega Drain, go! Drain that matchup dry of his life energies. Make him a withering husk. That would that would be quite terrifying, actually. Mega Drain, and it literally like you start like thinning out and just being absorbed of all your moisture. That's kind of intense. So to the comment award, I think we should move to that. We have last of the Mohagans. I don't know if that's deliberately a joke or a really bad misspelling, but either way, congratulations to you. And the reason his comment is here is because he's explained to me why, for example, the rich kid that I fought had a full restore. And apparently, a few of you said it as well, but I really liked how he did it. And apparently certain types of trainers have certain special things, like, for example, the rich kid having full restores. So it's a nice little neat thing that they've added. So, he has said, Rage, Winston is a rich boy, which, for those of you unenlightened, means that he could be considered owning a great deal of money. So he then can afford to... Well, okay, I'm going to read his actual wording, because it really is quite amusing. Actually, a lot of actually is going on here. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to do the puzzle of this gym while reading it. May not have chosen the best time for reading this comment. There's no need for Brawly to be involved. I'll crush you! All right, lady. Oh, God damn, you're really intense, aren't you? Bloody hell, battle girl Tessa. Meditate, meditate. In the world of Pokemon, one outlet for money is buying medicine from Pokemon, such as potions, status restores, or full restores. Being the best in both categories, a full restore is accordingly quite expensive. However, with sufficient funds, the likes of which a rich boy, a class of which young Winston here belongs, full restores can be purchased and used for battle. For a majority of trainers, using such an item on a low-level Zigzagoon would be unbelievably frivolous. However, rich boy Winston, having the assets to do so, could purchase a multitude of expensive items, even at his low level. TLDR, Winston's a rich idiot with no day job. I... Beautiful. I love that way of explaining that to me. That is fantastic. Congratulations to you, sir. All right, onwards with the gym and the various carnage. I do like how it piles gyms on you early. It kind of like powers you through the first four, five, then you got to deal with the team, then you power through the last three. But it's nice. You know, if it ain't broke, you don't necessarily have to fix it. That's that's the way of the world. Pursuit, eh? We will, we will learn Pursuit, just to give us some more coverage, a bit of dark going on. Nothing wrong with a bit of dark. In fact, that might be quite good, because I don't think fighting resists dark, so the psychic part of any psychic fightings will work quite nicely. And I, in fact, I'm going to test Pursuit out, just to see what kind of damage we're doing with it, because it is physical, and uh, Grovile is definitely more of a physical attack. That was, that was terrible. Oh, it is not very effective against fighting. Fighting has a lot more resistances than I remember, but... That's okay. We're gonna do the old reliable and just spam Mega Drain. That's how we do, everybody. We just spam Mega Drain. When in doubt, spam Mega Drain about. I'm sorry I've replaced the Squishy's catchphrase, but we don't have the Squish anymore. I do hope I happen across a Mario. I don't know if I'll be able to resist capturing it and just calling it Squishy again. Though I feel like that may be a little bit of... Uh, you know, I don't want to take up a six a valuable party slot with just a living reference to the legend of the X playthrough. I think it should be kept, you know, sacred. So, through here, down left, 
left, up, and right, like a boss. And here we. Huh. 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 I don't know what I'm doing, but it looks cool. What is, what is this? What kind of exercise is this? In what world? Hello, mister. How are you doing? I'm going to embarrass you and take your badge. In this amazing gym you've established. How are you doing? Pretty cool glasses there. I'm Brawly, you for the gym leader. I've been churning in the rough waves of these parts. I've grown tough using the caves on the outskirts of this tower as my training ground. As well as using the equipment in this gym. So you want to challenge me? Let's see what you're made of. Here, have a close-up of my abs. Brilliant. Thanks. Thanks, Brawly. Versus Brawly. Well, he's, did, was that just him punching the hell out of me? Because that seems a little bit upsetting. And here we have to deal with Machop. Really not the most impressive of Pokemon for a gym leader to have, but that's okay. That's okay. We're, you know, as, as the usual technique so far, we're just going to repeatedly Mega Drain him. You're going to use Bulk Up, eh? I bet you wish you could use Bulk Up, Brawly, don't you? Ho oh, ho! To be fair, being able to use uh, Bulk Up as a real-life human would probably save a lot of people quite a lot of effort. Maybe trivialize some things, but still, I think we could all agree that would be quite nice. And there we go. Gonzag Zig, Gonzag Zig. Baby Doll. Baby Doll Eyes! Are you kidding me? Alright, Gonzag Zig, hit him with those Baby Doll Eyes. Use a stairs at target with its baby doll eyes, which lowers. <laughs> I can't not. I'm sorry. I cannot not. <sighs> What's the difference between baby doll eyes and charm? I I'm gonna get rid of charm, I guess. Even though it's harsh, baby doll eyes goes goes first. But basically, I just have to. I have goon. Goon's egg and his baby doll eyes. Oh, that is amazing. I'm so happy, he just looks at you adorable, it's like, oh, I can't hurt that. That's his nickname, it's a goon baby doll eyes, Zag Zig, that's his full name now, I am happy. And, you know, just Brain Makuhita, difficult gym, I realise, very difficult gym we've got going on. I need a new Pokemon to share the XP around, I really do, but I've not encountered one that's caught my fancy yet, which is a little bit of a shame. Oh, uh, really, Makuhita? The gym lead is going to, um... He's going to use a full restore, isn't he? <laughs> An amount of Mega Trains. Yep, there it is. There's the Super Potion. God damn it. God damn it. Please crit. Please. Well, it did a little bit, I guess. Well, Quick Attack then is the only real thing. Oh, really? You avoided Quick Attack? And then threw sand in my face, you dirty, dirty fighter. Well, this battle is taking longer than I expected it to. Oh my god, I am going to destroy every machine in this place, Brawly. You fight like a little girl. Not gonna lie, you fight like a little girl. Stop throwing sand in Paul Lieutenant Leaf's face! You know how much that hurts? He's got sand in his eyes, they're red raw! Oh, there we go. Sit down, you cheap, cheap little Makahita, like little podgy yellow rolly thing. I don't know what you are, you weird. Whoa, whoa, you made me much bigger splash than I expected, bro. These are all the voices I think could easily come out of Brawly's mouth. Okay, you've got me. Take this gym badge. Boom, there it is, guys. Our second badge. Already our second badge. And I'm deliberately playing, you know, slowly and enjoying everything. That worries me a little. Well, not worries me, but more just, I guess I'm awesome. The knuckle badge makes all your Pokemon up to level 30, obey. And what? Oh, great, bulk up. Yay, I love bulk up so much. It's the best ability. Can't wait to teach it to literally every Pokemon I own. I can see your town becoming a giant wave that causes a storm of astonishment. Great. Look okay, in all this town. It's full of fascinating stuff like Rare Storm. My friend Steven rushed to the cave after I told him about it. Ah, Steven! You mean, coincidentally, the person with who which we have to uh, give a letter to? Well, isn't that just handily convenient? Also, it's the first time I've seen that guy behind a counter instead of next to the gym statue, so that's kind of cool. Probably should quickly hit the Pokemon Center, mainly so... I can get PP pee -pee, uh, back on Lieutenant Leafs. Otherwise, you know, he's going to have to be 
leafed out in the cold. Because he can't use Mega Drain. <laughs> ah, ding that leaf counter. Ding, 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 ding. Away we go. So, I'm hoping to not have an encounter every five steps in this cave. I mean, we all know I am going to have an encounter every five steps in this cave. But I choose to believe. I choose to enjoy my optimism. I really do. And I choose to hope that it is not a really populated cave. Or indeed a large one. Because sometimes you just don't want it to be a large one. <laughs> oh, the immaturity levels of this series are just so, so high. Do I, do I sneak or do I run? Oh, oh, hello, high command. You're totally going to battle me, aren't you? No! Oh, 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 hell, okay. Well, I'll see what you got to say. Okay. Oh, good, <laughs> good job I actually talked to him then, isn't it? That's, um... That's, that would have been very awkward. Oh, shouldn't have run. I got a little bit carried away, got a little bit cocky, and we are facing a... You! Not a chance in hell, you sand-throwing ball of annoying! We are leaving you behind. Oh, yes, we are. No, I could have said leafing behind! No, a missed leaf opportunity, guys! The first missed leaf opportunity! Oh, I'm so, so terrible. Oh, no. Oh, no. Groudon doing its thing. Kyogre doing its thing. Volcanoes. Oh, no. Hey, Steven. How you doing? You and your main character self. This is cool, though, isn't it? This is really neat. Lovely wall paintings of the legendaries doing their thing. What you got for me? You gonna tell me interesting stuff? I feel like you might do. Mm-hmm. So in the ancient world, their problem forms once held this much power. The super ancient Pokemon, what terrible strength. With this appearance here, it seems somehow different from Mega Revolution. Hmm, it's, it seems my questions will not be answered today. Hmm. <laughs> you are... Hmm. Hmm. I see. It's a pleasure, Josh. My apologies, my name is Steven. I'm interested in rare stones, so I travel here and there. Today my journey brought me here. But what about you? Oh, a letter for me? Ah, I see. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, I see. Oh, why, thank you. There must have been some trouble to track me down, and I suppose I must reappear you in some way. Let me see. I will give you this TM. Please accept it. It contains my favorite move. Steel Wing. Why is that your favorite move? It's like saying my favorite move's Tackle. Although probably all of you guys' favorite move is now Pound, so, you know, we're not going to go down that route again. If you don't mind me asking, do you feel anything in particular when you look at this wall? I feel like I'm going to capture Groudon, but that's maybe a far-fetched theory, actually. The terror aroused by that power is clearly to see in this ancient artwork. Yes, but not all power is terrible. Your Pokemon are clearly quite capable as well. Looking at you all together, I think you have what it takes to become a Pokemon League champion. R wow, guys, I wasn't sure before, but now I really think I can make it, so... And that's made me really happy. Cool, so we've delivered the letter to Steven, which means we can be on our merry way. Please don't give me an encounter on the way out. Don't do it. And if you do do it, don't give me a Makuhita. Okay. Yeah, yeah! That's how to cave, guys. That is how you cave all up in here. So the question is actually, do I go back on the ship now? Because I guess there's no real reason for me to stay here anymore, is there? Oh, I'm gonna go join this guy. Actually, you're gonna give me a fishing rod. Yes. Well, that was that was very convenient, actually. Good. We've acquired the old rod. I will never use you, but I will, you know, at least have you in my inventory until I get the good rod, and then maybe even the super rod. Who brands these things, honestly? Who brands them? Hey, look at Zigzagoon. Linoon. I wonder what it'll evolve into Linoon. There's a lot to be said for living. Okay, good. When I married my husband, I moved here from a large port of stale pot. Life goes by slowly on this island, being surrounded by the beautiful sea. That's the kind of happiness, too. Yeah, you guys you guys are getting divorced, aren't you? You can tell the tension's in the air. Okay, Mr. Sailor Man. Take us on home. But well, that reminds me. I've had a message from Peasant Stone saying it's another favor. Brilliant. Brilliant. Let's just, uh... <sighs> Let's just do more... More deliveries for Mr. Stone, because apparently that's that's all we're good for now. We've been reduced from a Pokemon Master in training to a delivery. So, 
to a delivery boy, in fact. Not just to a delivery, to a delivery boy. But that's okay. I'm sure one day I'll usurp uh, Mr. Stone and take everything he owns. So that makes me... That makes me happy. Yep, I will go deliver the parts to Mr. Stern Man. But, do you want to battle or? Okay, yeah, okay. He just seemed very confused at that sailor, so I had to go talk to him. Wow, Sailor Huey. Dude's buff. <laughs> ah, 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 ah. Don't know why I felt the need to point that out, but there we go, guys. I'll admit it when a sailor's buff. I'm gonna stop talking now. <laughs> I'm sick of facing fighting Pokemon though. I really am. Can we please have something that Lieutenant Leaf can super affect the hell out of? At least Mega Drain's providing a lot of healing, so that's good. Can't wait to upgrade it to Giga Drain! I'm assuming he does learn Giga Drain, because that would make a lot of sense. You're the best! I am the best. Thank you, Sailor Huey. I really am the best. That's nice of you. Really? I was like, oh, this guy's definitely not going to try and battle me. He's a little kid in a tuba ring. I was wrong. I was so very wrong. Tuba Ricky. And it's a Zigzagoon. I'm okay with facing a Zigzagoon. I'm not worried at all. I do love that we can see the town in the background while battling, though. It's a nice little touch there. And Mega Drain, away! Nearly. Nearly did it. I'm not sure if Dark or Bug is super effective against normal. Ah, the headbutt. Here it is. That did nothing, actually. I'm actually going to gain health via Mega Draining you, so that's awkward. I think being four levels ahead of random trainers on a route is pretty much okay, so I'm not that worried about that. Goodbye, Zigzagoon, and hello, a new level on Lieutenant Leaf! Nice! Gonna learn a new move? No, you are not. Well then, goodbye, Tuba Ricky. Groan! Did we, like, did we, like, throw his tube at him? Because I, 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 can, I can get behind that. So where's the entrance to the town? You've got lovely pearly streets. Hey, you've got a zigzagoon as well. We all do, apparently. Brilliant. Good, quick pollution message there. Did need a quick bit of pollution messaging. More tubers to fight. I guess we can go fight them if we feel we're a little bit low on the whole XP front. But I do want to get into the town. Okay. See, it's just so vast. No, okay, thanks for that amazing, astute... Observation. Good. Lighthouses. Lighthouses do fire beams of light really far away. That is actually, surprisingly enough, sir, that is literally the point of lighthouses. So, you being amazed by that is actually really quite weird, and you're bad and you should feel bad. Yay, an item! I had a sneaking suspicion that it would be the item I need. I don't really know what I'm talking about, but that's fine. Ooh, a beach hut! I want to go in the beach hut! See what I can do in the beach. Hey! Hey, lady, you followed me from the last town. I knew you couldn't resist. Boring Bells, I'm with the effort. Yes, that is what they're up for. Yes, fiery battles. Good. You were challenged by beauty, Johanna. Oh. Oh, you've called yourself beauty, have you? You shallow, shallow name. I don't really know where I'm going with this, but either way, I, I have a feeling that I'm going to annihilate go what? Lieutenant Leaf, Mega Drain Harder! Are we serial right now? Really, Goldine, that was that was you. Okay guys, I'm uh um, I guess the I guess the trainer of this Goldine is of course blonde. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, but I mean seriously though. Okay, okay, right, I I really like fiery hot battles, they're, they're my jam, so I'm going to use a water Pokemon. Okay, alright, got a water Pokemon for my fiery hot battles, and uh... No, it was not fiery hot! That was not fire. that was the opposite of fiery hot! What happened there it was a water Pokemon fighting a grass Pokemon, and you used a move that covered the entire arena in cold water! You did not get to call that battle fiery hot! You are an idiot! Not only are you an idiot, when faced with grass who is super effective against your Pokemon, you felt the need to weaken fire, which is the type of thing you wanted your battle to be. I don't care about you anymore. You could sit there and you could forget how to breathe. God damn it. That was beyond stupid. I'm leaving this hut. I don't care anymore. Some people in, in the Pokemon world, some people, you just some of them, honestly, some of the people. Back into the town. Oh, is that like a fairground? Yay! Uh, what you got for me? Did you know TM secret power? Okay. 
Ooh, sell me good stuff in secrecy. I want to be a member. Oh, it's a squishy doll. I'm going to sell cute dolls soon. I do like cute dolls being sold. So this will be for when. There you go. I'll pull all my energy into selling wood. You what you need. Bye. Okay, so that's where we get our EP up items. That's pretty good. Give your Pokemon something nice. I've put loads of energy into trading, Lieutenant Leaf. What is wrong with you? Oh, that is upsetting, actually. That is really, really upsetting. It's upsetting. Home boasts an abundance of seafood. Seaweed around here is full of fresh and life. Lovely. I love fresh and life things. Um, we got a Pokemon. I'm actually should. Oh, Hunklost on the wave. Struggle Bug can fight all moves I don't want, actually. Really. What patronage? I didn't buy anything. You don't, you have no idea what you're talking about, do you? And there is nothing else. Okay, well, I guess I'll figure out how to become a member via reading the comments on this video, where you'll tell me how to become a member, right? What is this? Pokemon Fan Club. Go on, then. I'll bite. I'll bite. I'll have a look. Oh, you really are all obsessed with Pokemon, aren't you? Skitty! Okay, thanks. Hello, old man. How are you? You doing good? Aha! <laughs> I'm the chairman of Pokemon Club. Being the chairman, I'm naturally the most important. No one can beat me when it comes to raising Pokemon. No one! Okay. Brilliant. Fantastic. You are a kind and loving gaze. My heart is overwhelmed. There's so much happiness! <laughs> oh, it's not bad, but it's not good. It's not good! Are you kidding? Lieutenant Leaf loves me. You are wrong. You are senile, old man. That's what you are. Okay. Good. Yep. Pokemon See, it's really friendly. Go tell that old man that he's just wrong. Yay, a Soothe Bell. They're really friendly, so now we can make them more friendly. So that's... That's good. Thanks for that. I, I, don't, I, don't think, I don't think I can handle listening to more. Oh, there was a Meryl there. Sweet. I don't think I can handle listening to more about how we need to love Pokemon. Honestly. Ooh, the Name Rater. Good. That's, that'll be kind of fun to see how he rates the various names we got going on. Okay, yeah. Yeah, let's let's rate this. Let's rate Lieutenant Leaf and Deathbring. I don't care about Goon's Egg Zeke. We know that's the best name in the world. Quite a fine... No! I don't want... No! It's quite a fine nickname. Why would I want to rename it? You guys, you have no idea. Oh, I tried to sneak up, sneak up on the child, but it didn't work. Probably shouldn't say that, actually. Oh, Pokemon Contest! Finally! Oh, that's exciting! No. Okay, so that's one he did the berries for. See, I prepared. I knew that might happen. Okay, that's good. Um, we got the Pokemon here. Nothing I particularly need from there. And is this the Poke Center? No, this is just a massive city. Well, this is cool. Nice. That'll be interesting when it's open. I imagine it will finish conveniently when the plot requires it to be finished. Because, you know, that's, that's how I like to operate in here. So I guess we'll have a go at the contest next time. And make sort of like... Goons like Zig dance around on the stage because, of course, he does whatever we tell him to do. He he is the party bitch like that, and you know I, I'm sorry, but there's no there's no way around it. It's just a requirement. All right, guys, that'll do for today's episode. I'm quite happy where we've got to. So for now, my name has been Rage. So let me know if you liked this, etc., etc. Remember to like if you, of course, did like it. Really helps support the series. Do appreciate it. You know the drill by this point. Keep the love flowing, guys. Let's make this awesome. And subscribe for more. Oh, goodbye.